So you're successful financially. But that's not all you need on the rocky road to self-actualization. Hey, little man. How much for the scooter? A hundred thousand bucks. No, that's ridiculous. Uh, no, that's, that's not gonna work for me. Uh, tell you what. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you this cinnamon danish here. I'm gonna take this, all right? Now, uh, scram and go, uh, go play with some kids, your, your size, all right? Go ahead and put in disc two to discover how to conquer the demons of your past. Neil, biggest dweeb in the class of apostrophe zero six. Alex, you've slain me this day, Neil. Get up, you're fine, man. No, no, it's too late, man. I'm food for the worms. <laughs> I knew I'd be the first to go. I'm not to mention the first to save a an innocent sweet boy from getting plowed down by your your car that you're recklessly driving through a school zone. Douche, Neil. Very douche of you. Yeah, I was always the first to do everything, wasn't I? Ever since high school. What are you talking about? Well, Neil, I was uh, the first to go through puberty. I was the first to uh, talk back to my mom. I was the first to say bad words. I was the first to discover E-bombs world. I was the first to get into story of the year. Uh, I was the first to, did I say first to feel boob? I was the first to uh, grow pubes, and then the first to shave them after I, after I grew uh, said pubes. Well, I think I was the first to uh, <coughs> co-found a multi-million dollar company. <laughs> oh, jumping the gun, Neil. If I recall correctly, Jesse Huddleston and Jill Carty got the superlative for most likely to be a millionaire. Is that your yearbook? Yeah. Yeah, actually, I don't think you... I don't think you got it. Superlative, whereas I got Big deal. two, two and a half superlatives. Uh, class clown, most likely to be remembered, and uh, runner up for uh, for most attractive. So I just remember you being an asshole, man. Looks like not much has changed. I'm sorry, I, I couldn't hear you over the death bells that you've brought forth. I, I um, actually, it's it's really kind of hard to even notice you, see you, or visualize you at all because my life's flashing before my my eyes and it's uh well it's awesome Neil you're so dramatic I'm gonna get home man have a nice life hey uh, I forgot to mention I was I was the first to get laid Neil and in, in our group of friends we weren't friends Alex you remember the uh, two-time prom queen yeah Melissa she's my wife congratulations man she's a great lay phenomenal lay <sighs> like you know Neil, I thought you knew. Uh, I was her first. It's my wife you're talking about. I have a lock of hair, Neil. A lock of Melissa's hair. Here. To remember her by. Sweet Melissa. Alex! Alex! Does she still do that thing with her tongue? Her tongue's so dexterous. Ah, shut up. Man, she had such a tight box. I can't speak for it now. But when I was pounding it, such a tight box. Do you please her, Neil? She loved my dick. Don't think I forgot about yours. She loved my dick! Neil! Neil! She loved my dick!
Femme à l'île, fauteuil.